In the realm of personal finance, few topics spark more curiosity than investing for beginners. For those with limited capital, the prospect of growing their wealth through investments can seem daunting, even mystifying. Yet, history has shown us that even modest sums can yield substantial returns when employed judiciously. The seeds of wisdom were sown centuries ago by pioneers like Benjamin Franklin and Albert Einstein, who understood the value of patience, prudence, and informed decision-making in cultivating wealth. Franklin's famous dictum, an investment in knowledge pays the best interest, encapsulates the essence of smart investing for beginners. By allocating a small portion of their income towards learning about personal finance, individuals can develop a deep understanding of the markets, their own risk tolerance, and the importance of discipline. In his autobiography, Franklin recounts how he invested in various ventures, including printing, real estate, and even a partnership in a land company, demonstrating that even modest means can be leveraged to achieve remarkable success. Similarly, Einstein's quote, the secret to creativity is knowing how to hide your sources, underscores the value of education and informed decision-making and investing. By staying informed about market trends, understanding the fundamentals of various asset classes, and avoiding get-rich-quick schemes, beginners can build a solid foundation for their investment journey. For those with little money, it's essential to start small. One effective way to begin is by setting aside a fixed amount each month through an automated savings plan. This discipline will not only help you develop a habit of saving, but also enable you to take advantage of compound interest over time. Consider opening a tax-advantaged retirement account or exploring low-cost brokerage options that offer minimal fees and commissions. Another strategy for beginners is to focus on dollar-cost averaging, where investments are made at regular intervals regardless of market conditions. This approach helps mitigate the emotional aspect of investing, as it eliminates the need to time the market or make impulsive decisions based on short-term fluctuations. By spreading your investments over a long period, you can ride out market volatility and potentially capture more growth. In addition to these fundamental principles, it's also crucial for beginners to understand their risk tolerance. Everyone has a unique comfort level when it comes to market uncertainty, so it's essential to calibrate your investment strategy accordingly. If you're risk-averse, consider allocating a larger portion of your portfolio to low-risk investments such as bonds, CDs, or money market accounts. One effective way to gauge your risk tolerance is by using the 50-30-20 rule. Allocate 50% of your income towards necessary expenses, 30% towards discretionary spending, and 20% towards savings and investments. By adhering to this framework, you can ensure that a significant portion of your income is dedicated to building wealth over time. As we navigate the complexities of investing for beginners, it's also essential to highlight the importance of patience and time horizon. Historically, markets have tended to trend upwards over the long term, with periods of volatility and downturns providing opportunities for investors to buy low and sell high. The key is to maintain a long-term perspective, avoiding emotional reactions to short-term market fluctuations. One fascinating example of this principle in action can be seen in the story of Peter Lynch, a renowned value investor who managed Fidelity's Magellan Fund from 1977 to 1990. Under his leadership, the fund returned an impressive 29.2% per annum, making it one of the most successful investment vehicles of all time. During this period, Lynch employed a value investing strategy that focused on identifying undervalued companies with strong fundamentals. Lynch's success was largely due to his ability to maintain a patient and long-term perspective, avoiding impulsive decisions based on shorter market noise. By staying true to his investment principles and adhering to a disciplined approach, he was able to build an impressive track record that has inspired generations of investors. In conclusion, investing for beginners is not about making quick profits or engaging in get-rich-quick schemes. Rather, it's about developing a deep understanding of personal finance, staying informed about market trends, and employing discipline and patience over the long term. By starting small, focusing on dollar cost averaging, and understanding risk tolerance, individuals can build a solid foundation for their investment journey. As we navigate the complexities of investing, let us remember the wise words of Franklin and Einstein, that an investment in knowledge pays the best interest and creativity is knowing how to hide your sources.